Welcome back. As we first reported back in August, a local business wanted to give back to their community. TNG Plumbing teamed up with other Mower County businesses for a pay it forward contest. And now we're introducing you to the family that says this gift went way beyond a bathroom makeover. ABC 6 News reporter Megan Rystad has our story. A little less than two months ago, the Grundmeyers made plans to give back to Mauer County. Give somebody in Mauer County a, a bathroom makeover, a new bathroom. It was all part of a paid-forward contest, and after more than 100 applicants, they finally found a fit. Oh, wow. Wow. This is great. The emotion just from Jason and Shannon and seeing it um, is... Uh, it's overwhelming. Jason and Shannon Furch. Jason's story and his um, determination and his drive and his uh, w hard work ethics um, always kind of pulled at us. 19 years ago, Jason's life was changed. In a fall from a billboard about 40 feet um, in 1995, landed on my back. It was a complete fracture of the T12 spine. And now he's getting back some of the convenience that was lost. It's not going to be a struggle every morning trying to fit into a small bathroom and have to make three to four different transfers just to get in the shower. But this project went beyond a bathroom. When the electrician was working in the basement and there's a junction box that comes downstairs from the bathroom uh, outlets and stuff and there was actually bubbling in the wires in the junction box. Uh, which is basically a fire waiting to happen. A risk that became reality when the Grundmeyer's home was destroyed by a fire in 2010. And there was a hallway that was up here. Proving the prize. If they just didn't remodel our bathroom. They saved our house and potentially our lives. Revealed more than a remodel. And we're supposed to be here. This is, this is where we're meant to be. In Austin, Megan Reistead, ABC 6 News. <laughs> TNG Plumbing says they plan to continue giving back and are already planning for next year's Pay It Forward contest that's uh, planned for March.